Seth Alexander here. We are live at Dream Team Prosthetics, Duncan, Oklahoma. Um, wearing some Sea Lake Fours today, and gonna go over how to sit down and stand up out of a chair. Now, over here, featured is a nice little chair. Typically, uh, you know, what I tell people whenever they're sitting down in some microprocessor knees, such as C Leg 4, um, you want to get a shoulder width stance with the knees. And from there, you are going to uh, more or less utilize the knee and its ability to bend. And you're going to put your butt back. And you're going to, you can use a hand on the armrest and you can use both the hydraulics of the knee and your arm to kind of position yourself to lower yourself down into the chair um, and basically it's the same thing getting up you can use one hand you can use two hands in my case I typically just use one and what I'm doing is I'm keeping that shoulder width uh, distance of my feet and kind of angling my feet outwards to create a you know triangle uh, sort of stance and from there it's about getting up and then getting your body weight over the center of the knees and then you're just going to squeeze your muscles fire them up and stand up now all together that is just sticking your butt out bending down and then standing back up and if you have to whenever you stand up you can kind of walk it out just until you get your balance and that's actually a really good exercise that you can do um, anywhere in a restaurant or at home just utilizing the knee technology and really practicing on control and stability and all of this actually will help you build up muscles over a longer period of time now I was using my right hand in the video it's also good to kind of switch it up and use your left hand too so that way you get proficient no matter what. So here is a regular chair with little handles and these are good especially if you're just starting out building up strength you can put both hands on the arms of the chair and just lower yourself in now the biggest part to focus on is using as much of your muscles as you can so although you're still using your arms you want to focus on trying to use your uh, leg muscles still so that way you're still building up muscle and strength in your legs and again you can use just one arm to help yourself get up sit down whichever arm you prefer and whenever you get a little bit better at it, you can utilize the rolly chairs, desk chairs, office chairs. These are a little bit trickier. And what I do is I will actually bend down and grab the seat right here in the middle. And then I just kind of hold it in place. And that's how I sit down in one of these. And now to get up, you're going to have to scoot to the edge of the chair a little bit so you can get your arm behind you. But you're still, you know, keeping that three-point stance and then just getting up like that. That way you don't risk the chair getting pushed out from underneath you. The biggest thing is to keep your body weight and center of gravity over the bend of the knee. Just like that. Good. Over and out.